In 1935, before the beginning of the Second World War, the German army produced the first of three stall homes to be used during World War II. The M35 was produced with high quality steel, but cost more to produce than the following stall home models, the M40 and M42. In 1940, Germany modified the M35 stall home to cut down on helmet production costs. This modified variant is known to collectors as the M40. This stall helm was once again produced with high quality steel like its predecessor, but as the war progressed, yet another way to cut down on helmet costs was needed. This resulted in the final variant of the stall helm, the M42. Due to the rising cost of the war and limited supplies, the M42 was produced with lower quality steel than both the M35 and M40 stall helms. The M42 was the most common stall helm to see service with the Wehrmacht, serving German combat troops along with the two earlier models. The three stall homes of World War II can be differentiated by two major distinguishing features, the ventilation holes and the rim. The M35 featured a rolled smooth edge and ventilation holes that are separate pieces from the helmet shell. The M40 again featured a rolled edge, but this time the ventilation holes were stamped directly into the helmet shell. Finally, the M42 featured a sharp flared edge and stamped ventilation holes. This is just a brief overview on how to identify the different World War II German helmet models. And for the sake of the video's length, we have left out World War I transitional helmets from the script. As always, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to help grow the channel, and I'll see y'all in the next video.